love it. Hello guys, this is your musician friend AK coming at you with the songs that you love to hear and play. Today's song is Hosanna, Blessed Be The Rock. And we're in the key of G flat. And guys, you know what? This is a nice foot stomping, hand clapping type song. And we're going to get into it on today. This was actually requested by Bernice Hughes. Thank you so much, Bernice, for giving us such an awesome song to work on. Thank you. And you know what? Before we start, I have to show you what I'm working with. Yep, I got my coffee. I got my, we're back to the coffee. Yep, I got to taste this. Let me give me one second. Let me taste my coffee real quick. Mm, it is so good. It tastes like heaven. Guys, I would love for you to go to your favorite refrigerator. Grab your favorite beverage. Come back to your keyboard, whether it be a Roland, a Casio, a Yamaha, whatever it is. Sit down at it and learn with me your favorite musician, your favorite instructor, AK on today. Guys, before we start, go ahead and hit that like. Bam, I see you just hit it. Thank you so much. It brings more people to our community. All right, let's get into it. We're in the key of G flat. That's G flat, A flat, B flat, B, D flat, E flat, F, and G flat. Of course, this is numerical melodies. We have to run through that with our numbers. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and stretch our knuckles out, crack them. Let's get it. I got one more. Let's take this time out and count our numbers. Easy song, guys. We're going to get through it. So it starts off with, Oh, magnify the Lord, for he is worthy to be praised. All right, easy, very easy. So we're just going one. On the one, we're playing this D flat six chord. On the two, we're playing this nice B7 chord. We're going right back to that D flat six chord, just inverted, and we're on the three. Oh yes, very nice G diminished seven chord, and that is on the six. For he, we're going to our two, and that's back on that B7 chord. He is worthy to, and that's same chord, guys, on the seven. B right and then we're back to that D flat 6 chord I have this nice turnaround that I like to do 
What is that? We're on a four. We're playing our G flat six chord on a four. Going to our three, regular D flat chord. And then we're on our two, and we're going, we're playing that B seven. This is the all star of the whole song. This B seven chord, <laughs> right? So we're on that B seven chord on the two, and then we just start over. And then that fourth time through, for he is worthy to be praised. All right, what do we do? So we're on our dominant seven chord right here on the G flat. We're going to walk up our three. We're playing a regular G flat chord, walking up to a B major chord on the four, going up to our A diminished seven chord on the five flat. And then we're ending with our G flat chord on the five. And then we're playing this nice turnaround that we always do in most of these songs. This is our F7 flat 5 chord. So next we're going, Hosanna, blessed be the rock. Let me give you that. We're on our G flat dominant 7 chord. We're playing this nice boogie woogie in our left hand. That's 1, 3, 5, 6, back to the 1. Now when we hit this 6, we're going to change our chord right here to a regular B chord, regular B major chord. So that'll sound like Hosanna. Then we're going to walk up to our 4. So that walk up is basically 1, 2, 3 flat, 3, 4. And right there on the 4, we're going to play this B dominant 7 chord. Next we're going to our 5 flat. Playing our A diminished seven chord, walking up to our five regular G flat chord. And then we go to our one, and we're playing a G flat dominant seven chord. We repeat that. Blessed be the rock. And we're gonna walk down to our two. All I'm playing is four, three, three flat, two. Right there on the two, we're playing this chord. And we walk up to our five. All right, what is that walk up? We're going three, four, five flat. And then we change up our chord right there on the five. And that is a D flat dominant seven chord. We repeat. Hosanna, blessed be the rock. Blessed be the rock of my salvation. That last time through, we're going on a two. We're playing that uh, A flat dominant seven chord. Going to our five, and we're playing this D flat dominant seven, and then we're ending with a regular G flat major chord. Then you could do that walk up again. It's something I did at the very end. I did something very cool. It was like, blessed be the rock. Blessed be the rock. All right, what am I doing? I'm playing on the four. I'm playing a regular B major chord. Going up to the five flat. I'm playing this A diminished seven chord. And then I'm playing my G flat major chord on the five. Then we're doing this nice little thing. What is that? We're just playing five, six, one. And it's a timing thing. Ba -da -ba, ba -da -ba. So, Hosanna, blessed be the rock. Right here. Blessed be the rock. All right, guys, that's the whole song. I hope this was able to help you out. Awesome lesson. Today's life lesson is always trust your gut. I remember being young when my friend and I hit the carnival, eager to try every game in sight. But then we spotted the game, you know the one, suspiciously empty, with a sketchy vendor lurking behind it waiting like a spider. So naturally, we kept walking. But this guy wouldn't let us go. He zeroed in on me, waving his arms, hey big guy, strong dude like yourself could definitely win a stuffed animal for the lady. I tried to brush him off with a polite no thanks. 
but he hit me with, come on, first place free? You got $10? Just put it on the table. I figured, hey, no harm in showing him $10, right? So out it came, sitting there on the table like bait. The game, easy. Just throw three balls in a basket. I mean, how hard could that be? I hadn't even said I was playing yet, but he's already shoving a ball into my hands. Go on, he says. So I throw the ball nice and easy right into the basket, or so I thought. It bounces right back out like I had thrown it up against the trampoline. I stared at him, dumbfounded. He grinned, leaning in with a smug. Loser, loser. And then poof, the guy grabs my $10 like who did. I stood there, wallet lighter and ego bruised, watching the vendor come me out of my money. And that's when it hit me. If something seems too easy, or the guy running it is way too eager, it's probably a setup. Life lesson, always trust your gut and never flash your cash at a carnival. Awesome job, guys. Let's give ourselves a hand. Thank you so much for hanging out with me on today. I want to tell you that I really appreciate it. And I hope that you all are telling others about this channel and telling them how much you're growing and how much that this channel is helping you to be a better musician. I hope you're doing it. I hope I'm crossing my fingers and I'm hoping that you're doing that. If you're not, please go and tell somebody about this awesome channel and this awesome community. And guys, you know what? We have a Facebook page. I would love for you to go and check it out. It's me playing all of the songs that I love to hear and play. And of course, I hope you do as well. And we have a new section. It's just called Viewers Request. If you have a song that's on your heart, tell me about it and I will play it. It's Viewers Request. Guys, you know what? We have a bell also. I would love for you to hit that bell because a video that is new is coming right to you. And right next to that bell, my favorite part of the video is the subscribe button. You know, I have a little birdie here on my shoulder. The birdie said it takes like three seconds to hit that subscribe. I don't think he's lying. I'm going to test him out. Let's see. Three, two, one. Bam! He was right. I see you just hit it. Thank you so much. You are not just playing the music. You are the music. This is AK signing off.